the day we start at the moment, a family member in this room is organizing a party, so I'm getting some bags for some gifts. In this room, they have like special celebrations when Sabiandi turns a round number, like 10, 20, 30, 40 and up, and every round year has a different color. This person is turning 60, so the color is purple, so we're getting purple gift bags. One eternity later. So I went for a walk again and grabbed me some lunch at Joe and the Juice. I'm really loving the hikes at the moment, especially in between work. I feel like this activity allows me to observe my surroundings and most importantly to reset after a day of work. So guys, I'm on my way to Renaissance Spa where I'm going to get a couple of treatments. The first treatment is the cryotherapy. It's a treatment to activate, revive your immune system by immersing yourself in a minus 110 degrees Celsius chamber. I also did the floating a couple of days earlier, so let's jump to that treatment. I needed some tempering, so I went to Renaissance, that's a spa in Amsterdam South, and I decided to go with the floating this time. Let me show you around. So this is what the space looks like, a shower, a sink to wash your hands or your face, and then we have the floating bed. Floating is meant to rejuvenate your body, your mind, your soul, it's just it's just a relaxation. Uh, they put some Vaseline over here and that is for open wounds to make sure it doesn't bind. And then we have the floating uh, cushion. This session is about 60 minutes. It's not my first time floating. If you like relaxation, if you like pampering yourself, please do this. After a little floating session of about 60 minutes, you feel so light, so relaxed. something you need to do. So I'm going to enjoy myself and get into the bed. So guys, I'm, um, the floating room is really hot and the benefit of that is that you're getting rid of all of the toxins in your body, the combination salt, heat, it's a golden one. Sixty minutes was a little bit long for me, so I decided to do some work on my telephone, dip my toes, and let me show you around the building. This is one of the main entrances where clients wait for their treatment. So the building that the Renaissance Spa is in has multiple rooms like this massage room, you have the sauna, the ice bath, this is the locker room where you find the showers, where you of course can clean up on yourself after a yoga session or any of the other classes that they're offering. So guys, like I said in the beginning, I did the cryotherapy as well, which is a cold therapy that takes that to the next level by exposing the entire body to extreme cold. Renaissance also has multiple yoga classes. I follow the restorative class, which is yoga that's a little bit slower than the regular so, class. I promise you guys to take you along with me to the Kwaku Festival in the last episode. The Kwaku Festival is a yearly event in Amsterdam Southeast and the festival takes place during a number of weekends in the summer.
The festival includes a soccer tournament and other than that there's a lot of music and tropical food. It's very much started as a Surinamese festival and a place to be seen and be seen. Nowadays you have other Caribbean groups and people from Africa. Guys, I can assure you that these Surinamese cakes were top notch. I also bought some cookies, my favorite, the cornflower ones and the one with peanuts. So the Kwaku Festival is a multicultural festival and as a night further, crowds come from every crack in the Netherlands, especially Caribbean people celebrate. It's like a big meetup. Some people haven't seen each other for years and when they go to Kwaku, they meet childhood friends, family members. It's just all fun and play. They have nice food, great vibes, live music. It's really something that you need to experience. Here in the Netherlands, please go to the Kwaku Festival. It's a four week weekend festival, back to back. Thanks for watching, see you in the next vlog.